Chapter 16 West Coast and East Coast Two curious cousins, Ria and Ayan, are talking to each other on a Google Meet. While talking, they decide to explore each other's cities. Ria lives in Puducherry, a coastal town with a rich history. Ayan lives in a serene coastal city known for its Portuguese influence, Daman. Ria excitedly exclaimed, Aryan, I can't wait to tell you all about Puducherry. Puducherry used to be a French colony, so you'll see a lot of French influence here. It's like a little piece of France in India. We still have a strong French influence in our architecture and culture. She gestured to the colorful French colonial buildings in the background. Do you know? Puducherry was known by the name Pondicherry. She added, and that's the promenade beach. This is one of our most beautiful spots. People come here to relax and enjoy the sea breeze. Close to this beach is a white town area, which is built in such a way that it resembles cities of France. It is known as the Little France. Ayan leaned closer to his screen, eager to hear more about the city. Tell me more. Ria said, one of the most famous landmarks is the Aurobindo Ashram, founded by Sri Aurobindo and the Mother. It's a place of meditation, yoga and spiritual growth. Besides these, there are some temples, there is a statue of Mahatma Gandhi, a French war memorial and the Sacred Heart Catholic Church. Ayan nodded in fascination. Daman also has a rich history. It was a Portuguese colony, he shared. Do you know that the city is divided into two regions by a river called Daman? Ganga. The two regions are known Moti Daman, big, and Nani Daman, small. To reach the other side, the river has to be crossed. He added that Nani Daman is busier out of the two regions. Do you know? The Portuguese called the city of Daman, Damao. Ayan said, we can feel the Portuguese touch in every nook and corner of Daman. The buildings, the churches, cuisines and the culture. All are a blend of foreign culture and the local traditions. Some places to visit in Daman are Devka Beach, Moti Daman Fort, Church of Bomb Jesus, Dominican Monastery, Jampur Beach, Mirsol Water Park, Governor's Palace, Jetty Garden, Panikota Fort, House of Bokaj. Ria smiled. That's very interesting. Now, let's talk about food. In Puducherry, we love our French pastries and seafood. And there's this delicious dish called Puducherry. Dosa, which is a fusion of Indian and French cuisine. There are also some more popular fusion dishes like Pondi Mossaka, Quiche, Creeps, and Salad Nikois. And the Medu vadas and pineapple shira are dishes I can eat every day. Aryan's eyes lit up. Wow, that sounds yummy. In Daman, we are famous for our seafood too. People come from far and wide to taste our fresh fish curry, crabs and lobsters. Fish kolivara, a spicy fried prawns dish, is said to have its origin in Daman. Even Gujarati sweets like laddu, basundi, jalebi, barfi, lapsi are also quite popular here. As they talked about food, Ria's stomach rumbled audibly, making Aryan laugh. It seems that someone is really hungry, he teased. Ria changed the topic. On the outskirts of Puducherry is Auroville, a unique experimental township. It was founded by Mira Alfasa who is popularly known as the mother and was designed by the architect Roger Anger. It is famous worldwide for its concept of human unity in diversity. As they continued sharing stories and knowledge, they realized how different yet beautiful their cities were. Ria said, Aryan, I hope you get to visit Puducherry someday. Aryan grinned. And I hope you come to Daman too. We can explore the historical 
sights and have some amazing seafood together. Ria felt a deep sense of gratitude for technology, which allowed them to bridge the distance between Puducherry and Daman. As the sun set, Ria and Aryan reluctantly said their goodbyes. Until next time, Aryan. Ria said, waving goodbye. Take care, Ria, Aryan replied. And remember, when you visit Daman, I'll be your tour guide. With promises to reconnect soon virtually, they ended their video call, both feeling lucky to have such a wonderful cousin and friend.